ماشاءالله ناو پارتی جانا مبتی دا ویریج دا خبر بی خیر ویریج بی خیر جار مجرور شبو جملہ خبر آر یو ویت می جار مجرور شبو جملہ خبر and then واو از اطف and what is الحمدو مبتی دا ویریج دا خبر للہی جار مجرور شبو جملہ خبر see it's easy now but at least you know exactly what you are saying. You are just not memorizing, but now you are saying exactly. You know, the words are part of you now. Okay, but then most of the time you will also hear this way. Kaifa haluka ya khi bikhair. What will he say? Bikhair. What did he say? Only he said the khabar. Muftida? He, he ate it. Maybe he was too hungry. Or oh, he was too much in rush. Actually, it is ana bikhair, but he say bikhair. So muftida can be dropped. Muftida in only in this particular case. Or you, if I ask you, masmuka yaqi, he will say Muhammad. So Muhammad is khabar. What is the muftida? Ismi, Is, ism was dropped. Ismi Muhammad, he just dropped it. But it is there, and Muhammad is only the khabar. Ready? Minayna anti. Huh? If I have to ask brother, minayna anta. From where you are? If I ask a sister, minayna anti. And what is the answer? And I'm in Syria. What is Syria? Syria. Huh? And I'm in Syria. You will say, and I'm in Canada. Okay? Fine. Masmuki. Huh? Masmuki. What is your name? Ismi Amina. What is Ismi? My name. Where is Muftada? Ismu. Wa huwa muda. And ya mutakallim? Mudafili. And what is Amina to? Khabar. MashaAllah. Aina Abu ki. See Abu ki. Ki tells me you are born as anti. Aina Abu ki. Where is your father? Abi. What is Abi? My father. More than that. Abu Muftada wa huwa mudaf and ya mutakalim mudaf ilayhi. Break it. Abi is two words. Abu plus ya mutakalim. Father and my. Okay, my father. Father of mine. If you say of, then you'll say father of mine. Abi huna. What is huna? Zarf. It only came on its own. Zarfu makan. فِي الْمَدِينَةِ الْمُنَوَّرَةِ So, فِي الْمَدِينَةِ الْمُنَوَّرَةِ فِي عرف شار المدينةِ اسم مجروب and نعت منوَّرَة is the نعت هو This is simple. What is هو? مبتدا. Where is the خبر? مفتشون What is the مفتشون inspector? مفتشون فِي الْمَدْرَسَةِ الْمَدْرَسَةِ ثانویتی فی المدرست ثانویتی فی حرف جار اسم مجرور and then what is that نات ثانویتی is المدرست ثانویتی is نات منود انشاءاللہ but we got جی secondary secondary school okay he's the inspector in the secondary school okay brother we will say fil madrasi only jar majroo, nothing more. Waina ummuki, and where is your mother? You can translate, inshallah. Hiya aidan huna, full stop. He, she is also here. So what is hiya? Mufta. Where is the khabar? Huna. Huna is your khabar. What will you call huna? Zarf. When you say zarf, what will you say? Shibu jumla khabar. If it comes as a khabar, shibu jumla khabar. Fine, brother. Hiya tabibatun. Okay. She is a doctor. Where is she the doctor? Fi mustashfal viladati. Fi mustashfal viladati. In the maternity hospital. Now, you know, fi is harfcha. We need isam majroor. Where is isam majroor? Mustashfa. But you see, it ends with a ya, so we don't see the vowel signs. Remember, fa, fata is not on ya, it is before ya. 
There is no vowel sign on ya. This is a special noun. We will learn later on, inshallah. Okay. Then it is ism majroor. And at the same time, it is mudaf. And al viladati is mudafilihi. Okay. Fine, brother. Man hadihil fatatullati maaka. Okay. Brother, we learn other day fatan. What did we learn? Fatan uh, means young, young fellow, uh, young fellow. Uh, okay, 15, 16, you know, young fellow. If you put al, then it will become al fata. Uh, Tanmin will go away. This is also a special noun. We are going to learn later on in book three. And the, what is the monas of this? Fatatun. What is it? Monas of them is Fatatun. What is it? Fatatun. Fa, ta, and then tun. And you put al, it will become al, fa, ta, tu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? So what is al fatatu? Young lady. Uh, al fatatu is young lady. Fine, brothers and sisters. Man hadihil fatatu lati maaka. Because it's a question mark, we won't analyze. We will just translate. Who is this young lady who is with you? Who is this young lady who is with you? Ahiya uhtuki. Is she your sister? La. No. Okay. Hiya bintu ammi. Bintu ammi. Okay, brother. What is hiya? Mubtada. Bintu ammi. How many words are there? Three. Three. Mashallah. But once you can identify then then our job becomes easy. What is, where is the khabar? Bintu, wa huwa mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi? Ammi, without ya. Huh? And then ya mutakalam is afterwards. Let me write down, brother. Bintu, I'm writing like this so that you can easily break it down. What is bintu, brother? Khabar. Huh? And at the same time, it is mudaf. And what is this, brother and sisters? Mudaf ilahi. Wa huwa mudaf. And then this is mudaf ilahi. Got the idea? So we got three words in it. If you can understand this, brother, what shall I say? You are excellent. Huh? This is a very beautiful thing. And inshallah, then you are understanding what we call it in Urdu, pukhta. Your understanding is clear and it's, it's uh, comprehensive. Comprehensive. Okay. Okay. Masmuha. What is the translation? What is her name? How will you reply? Ismuha Fatimatu. What is Ismu? Mubtada. Huwa mudaf. Where is mudaf ilahi? Ha. Okay. And then Fatimatu. Khabar. Ready? Ahiya zamila tuki. Is she your classmate, colleague? Brother, before was Zamilu. Now it became Zamila Tu. Why Tu? Muannas. Huh? What is the answer? La. No. Ana. Muftada. Film. How would you analyze this? Ha. But it is a question. We don't analyze. We'll get confused. Brother. Okay, Zamila Tuki, what is Zamila Tuki itself? Ah, two words, what are they? Mudaf, Mudaf, Khalas. That's good enough. Ana, Mubtada, where is the khabar? Fil madrasatith, fil madrasatil mutawasitati. Mutawasitati. Ana, Fil madrasatil mutawasitati. Okay, brother, fine. What is fee? 
al chair. Where is this majroor? Al madrasati. And what is al mutawasitati? Naat. Middle school. What is it? Ana, I am in the middle school. Wahiya, and she is fil madrasati thanaviyati. Fil madrasati thanaviyati. She is in the secondary school. Okay, fine. Alaki ukhtun. Alaki ukhtun. Because this dialogue is between two ladies, you know. Alaki ukhtun. What is it, brothers and sisters? Do you have a sister? La. What is la? Harfu, harfu nafi. Hai. This is harfu nafi. Mali, mali ukhtun. Mali Ukhtun. Now let us analyze ma li ukhtun. Huh? Ma is a nafi, arfu nafi. What is li? Jar majru, shibu jumla, khabar mukaddam, and khabar has come in advance. And where is muftada? Ukhtun. You see it is indefinite, it came late. Okay? When the muftada is definite, it doesn't need coffee. When muftada is indefinite, he feels drowsy, so he stops at Tim Horton. And then he comes in the lesson a little late. <laughs> huh? Okay? But when the muftada is uh, definite, he does not like coffee. He comes right away. Huh? Okay? Ready? A lucky akhun. Do you have a brother? What is the answer? Naam. Li akhun. Kabirun. How will you analyze that, brother? Li, Jar Majroor, Shubhu Jumla Khabar. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Sister Salma? Huh? Where is Muftada? What is uh, Kabirun uh, Abir? Naat. Huh? Naat, okay. Wa huwa and Ataf huwa. It's a new sentence. Muftada and Talibun Khabar. What is Bil Jamiati? Jar Majroor. Khalas. Jar Majroor. Wa man hadal tiflul ladhi ma'aki. And who is this little fellow with you? Huh? Tiflu is a male child, huh? little boy, you know. Wa man hadal tiflul ladhi ma'aki. Who is this little fellow? Who is with you? Wabnu Akhi. He is son of my brother. Look at it. Ibnu Akhi. How many words? Three words. MashaAllah. Now if there are three words, we can easily analyze, you know. Huwa Muqtada. Where is the khabar? Ibnu. Wa huwa Mudaf. And what is Mudaf ilahi? Akhi. Without Jia. And then Akhi becomes Mudaf. And ya mutakalam becomes mudafilihi. Inshallah it is clear to you. Masmuhu. Huh? Huh? See? See how Dr. Saab is using all these different pronouns. Masmuhu. What is his name? Masmuhu. Huh? What is the answer? Ismuhu. Saadun. So, ismu mubtada huwa mudaf hu mudafilihi. Ummuki fil bait al ana. How will you translate? Is your mother in the house now? La. Brother, what is the sentence? Jumla failure. It came Jumla failure. Huh? Are you with me, Sister Salma? Look at the sentence. Huh? There is no ism in the beginning. It's a verb in the beginning. Zahabat ilal mustashfa. Okay, but what is zahabat? Fial. Analyze it properly. Where is the fial? Zahaba. Where is the verb? Zahaba only. What is next one? Tautani. So we analyze it. Huh? Zahaba is the verb. And what is next? Tautani. See? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? And where is the file? 
מוסתתר משה אללה, משה אללה. whenever I ask uh, in the class, uh, sometimes somebody who's either not paying attention or maybe he forgot, he says, ah, but where is the file? Ta is the file. I said, brother, I got a very weak heart. Don't say these things. Ta is a ta uthani si. Feminine. It only tells us that the doer of the action is a feminine. File is mustatir in this particular case. Eh? And what is ilal mustashfa? Jar majur. Now, brother, these questions, okay, number one, ekra waktub, read and write. Okay, no vowel signs. Because now Dr. Abdurrahim thinks you have all become expert. And you will figure out yourself whether the noun is a marfu or majroor. We are, we are not learning mansub, so that is one consolation. We don't have to worry about putting fatas there. Huh? Okay. Now see whom the question is asked. Ya abhi. So then the pronoun has to be masculine. Are you with me? So what will you say? Kaifa haluka. Huh? This is, we have to figure out now. Kaifa haluka ya abhi. Next one is ummi. What will you say? Kaifa halu ki ya ummi. Got the idea brother and sister? You will write down brother and sisters and put proper vowel signs. Okay. Now you are asking Zainab. Huh? You are asking Zainab. Yes, Brother Farooq. Oh, my father. Ya, oh, Abi, my father. Huh? Ya, we are going to tell you a lot. Uh, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to, brothers and sisters, I'm just trying to uh, take my time. I would love to explain you these things. But I want to take my time. Ya is called harfu nida. What is it called? Now by this time you know harf. It's a particle. Nida is calling. Harfu nida. Ya is a harfu nida. Huh? In English we call it vocative particle. Vocative particle. But we will prefer to use Arabic terminology. Harfu nida. Huh? And if there is a harfu nida, then there is a munada. The one who is called. But we are going to take this different time, inshallah. Not today. Huh? Okay. Now you are asking Zainab. So watch. Huh? So, Aynabnu ki. Ya Zainab. Where is your son, O Zainab? Aynabnu ki. Huh? Because you are asking Zainab. Okay. What is the answer? Zahaba ilal masjid. See, now the verbs will come. But only simple verbs in the simple form it will come. Okay. What is Zahaba, brothers and sisters? Fi'al Mahdi. Where is the fa'il? Mustatar. He went to the masjid. Ilal masjid, jar masjid. Next one, Ya Amina. Aina bintu ki ya Amina. See, brother Muhammad, you can figure out now. Uh, from the sentence, whether it is ka or it is he, depending on whom you are addressing. Aina bintuki ya amina. What is the answer? Zahabat ilal madrasati. How will you translate? She went to the school. Zahaba fiel tau tanisi, and the file is mustatir. Mashallah, mashallah. Alhamdulillah. Now there are two questions. So we are not going to analyze those. We will only translate. Liman hadhi saatul jamilatu. Liman hadhi saatul jamilatu. Are you with me? Okay. Ahiya. What will you say? Ahiya la ki. Because it is Fatima. Ahiya la ki ya Fatima. Translate brother. For whom is this beautiful watch? Belong. Yes. Yeah. And then next one, brother. Is it for you? Does it belong to you? Fatima. What is the answer? Nam. 
No, what is the hiya? Li. Li. Okay, brother, what is hiya li? It belongs to me. What is hiya? Muktada, where is the khabar? Li, what is li? Jar majur shibu jumla khabar. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Yes. Yeah, Aina bin Tuki. You know why key? Because you are asking a sister. Where is your daughter? <coughs> bin Tuki. Huh? Fine, brothers and sisters. Ahada kalamuka ya Muhammad. Translate, brother. Is this your prayer? Muhammad. Muhammad replies, La. Hada kalamuka. This is your pen. Okay. Hada muftada. Where is Khabar, Kalamu, Wahuwa Muftada, Mudaf. And where is Ka? Mudafili. And what is this Anta doing here? Anta should not come here. Huh? It is coming here for Tawkeed, for emphasis. Huh? Because Anta is a brother pronoun which is Marfu. It comes as a subject. Muftada, most of the time. All of the time rather. Okay? So, it comes as a subject, it comes as a muptada all the time. Okay? But here it is coming at the end of the sentence, so it means for emphasis. For emphasis. Are you with me? For emphasizing. Hada kalamuka anta. This is your pen, your. Are you with me? This is your pen, your. Just for emphasis. Okay? Yes. Just to make it a stronger point, huh? Huh? you can sometimes use that. You can use that to make your point more uh, strong. Okay. Okay, brother, keep your pencils ready because we are getting is uh, ismul mausula, and we will try to figure out silatul mausul. Huh? We'll try to figure out silatul mausul, and we will try to figure out where is muftada and where is khabar. You know, muftada can come in the beginning and the khabar can be mile away at the end of the sentence. Okay? We have to figure out. Tilka sayaratul jamilatu. No vowel signs. I cannot give a kasra here. There is no harf jar. Tilka sayaratul jamilatu. What is tilka? Ismushara. Muftada. And what is the sayaratu? Badal mashallah. Are you with me? Shara came and then Alif Lam came with the noun. And what is Jamila to? Naat Masha. And Allati. Isam Mausula. Allati is Isam Mausula. Which? Okay, now comes Kharajat. Al Ana min al Madarasati. Yini, it went out. Kharajat. Brother. Kharajat, remember Kharaja and now Tao Tanishi. You want to put vowel signs, brother? Kharajat. Kharajat. This is Tao Tanishi. Okay. Kharaja is verb, Tao Tanishi is the sign of feminine. And where is our file? Mustatir. What is the estimation of it? Takdiruhu. Here, because it is, see third person here, and here goes to where? To car, to the car. Allati, it goes to Allati, and Allati goes to the car. Are you with me? So in other words, the, the file goes to the car, uh, inshallah. Allati, Al-Ana, what is Al-Ana? Zarf of Zaman, uh, Edward of Time. And what is Minal Madrasati? Jar Majroor. Khalas? Okay. Okay. And then what is Lil Mudiri? Shibu Jumla Khabar. Are you with me? Sister Salma, I'll go slowly. Huh? Now, Sister Salma, tell me, huh? remove everything. Just give me Muftada and Khabar. Tilka Sayaratul Jamilatu. You got the idea? Huh? That is our main sentence. 
تلکا سیارتو الجمیلتو اوکی تلکا مبتدا سیارتو بدل الجمیلتو نات لل مدینی ایج یور جار مجور شبو جملہ خبر but then we got اسم الموصول اللتی and where is the سلط الموصول خرجت الان من المدرستی پدر put a bracket with اللتی up to مدرستی with a pencil پدر محمد you already got it now you can underline سلط الموصول which is خرجت اللتی is اسم موصول where is the سلط الموصول خرجت 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 العالم من المدرسة Are you with me? Did all of you get it? Sister Arifa Inshallah Sister Maimuna Aisha Inshallah Yes Of course we did it You were too busy No, okay No, okay I will explain again Actually, you know I'm not supposed to tell you these things. Huh? I, uh, uh, Dr. Abdurim may get upset with me. What are you doing? These are to be done in book three. But I felt these are very beautiful things and you are very smart and intelligent. So I'm taking a chance and explaining you all these things. Huh? The simplest way, brother and sister, I'll give you two sentences. Huh, brother? Al-Kitabu Al-Lazi Al-Al-Maktabi Lil-Mudarris Are you with me, brother? What is Al-Kitabu? And now Allah is describing that. So it is Ismu Mausula, but I can still call it as a Naat. Because it is describing, isn't it? What does Naat do? It gives further description of Manaut. So remember Haza, Ismu Shara. Fine. Haza can be a file, Haza can be an object, Haza can be an Ism Majroor. Haza can be Mubtada. Haza can be anything. Depends what role it plays in the sentence. Similarly, brother and sister, Allazi can be file, can be adjective, naat, can be a Mubtada, can be khabar, can be anything. That is a different thing that we will describe. And, but the thing is that after Allazi, there will be a phrase or a sentence which will be specially connected to it. It will be specially connected to it. Are you with me? And that connection is called Silatul Mausul. It's connecting to the... Okay. Now look at this sentence. Al-Kitabul Lazi al-Al-Maktabi. If you remove Al-Ladhi and the Sila connection, what is left now? Al-Kitabu Lil-Mudarris. Are you with me? What is left now is Al-Kitabu Lil-Mudarris. So, brothers, we say Al-Kitabu Mubtada. What is it? Mubtada. Al-Ladhi is Ismu Mausula. In this case, it is not. But that is going too far, too advanced. But... I will say a few things if you understand, Alhamdulillah. And if you don't understand, what do I always say? Don't worry. <laughs> because we will be, don't be gabrified. Don't be gabrified. We will be repeating it so many times that inshallah, inshallah, you will, by the end of the course, you will all become very, very strong, all of you. And I pray that may Allah grant you success in this course. Brothers and sisters, you are very, very special. You have taken your time off from your daily lives, sacrificed yourself 
coming here, long distance driving, and then at home you go and do your homework. But brother, nothing comes without effort. Huh? No pain, no gain. Remember this, no pain, no gain, brother. So, brothers and sisters, what is Alal Maktabi? Jar Majur. What is doing it here? It is connected with Allah. See. So, I will call Alal Maktabi Silatul Mausul. What is Silatul Mausul? Huh? Huh? Because this is connected with Kitab. Are you with me? Try to understand. If you don't understand, I, sh I say, don't worry. Can you translate, Sister Salma? Yeah, the book. Um, which is? is on the table. Ah. The yeah. So on the table is connected with which? Okay. Now I write another sentence. Now, brother. What did I write, brother, sisters? What did we write? Translation, brother. The new student. India. Mashallah. Excellent. So you see, you can translate. Huh? Uh, Mashallah. That is beautiful. Now we analyze. Where is our Muptada and where is our Khabar? Only tell me, tell me Muptada and Khabar. A Talibu is your Muptad. Huh? And where is the Khabar? Minal Hindi. So you remove everything and just give me Muftada and Khabar. A Talibu Minal Hindi. Khalas, brother. That is the main sentence. But then you are describing that student. Okay. A Talibul Jadidu. What is Jadidu? Naat for Talib. Okay. And then Al Lazi is also a Naat because further describes. But Al Lazi is Ismu Mausula. Huh? Okay. So where could be the Silatul Mausul? Kharaja ana mil al fasli. So, what is Kharaja? Fiel. Where is Fiel? Mustatir. Takadiruhu huwa. Al ana zarfu zaman. And then mil al fasli jar majur. So, I will say that this thing, brother and sister, is Silatul Mausul. But this is, we are supposed to do in book 3. But I think. Because this is an intensive course, and you are all very strong, mashallah. So I am, uh, you know, getting a little bolder and telling you many things which we will be later on studying. But even if you understand, Sister Salma, 75%, that itself will make later on things very easy for you. Yes, Sister Naima? Silatul Mausul? What did I write, brothers, sisters? Look at this vowel signs. Silatul Mudaf Mudaf Alhamdulillah. This is the way you will always figure out. Silatul Mausuli Mudaf Mudaf Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Ismul Mausulu. What is it? There will be always Al Ismu Al. Mausulu. Are you with me? And that it will have a... Okay, now I give you something. I, I'm just... I'm just... Uh, because this comes in the Quran and we, we say it all the time. I would love to explain you Surah Al-Fatiha, brother. I would love to explain you Surah Al-Fatiha. And when you will understand it properly, it will give you so much joy, brother. Inshallah. I want you to get a little more stronger. Huh? Okay. Basic things. Huh? And a scholar can speak for days on Surah Al-Fatiha. Huh? Scholar can speak. Huh? But we are doing something which is straightforward, taking the meaning 
and then trying to understand with our small intelligence what it means, you know, from the understanding of the language. Okay? Ihdina Sirat al Mustaqim. What is after that? Sirat al Ladina. See, alay him. Huh? You say alay him. Okay. Now, sirata is a mansub. There is a reason for it. We are not going in detail because we haven't studied uh, that uh, mansub. Uh, why the noun becomes mansub. Later on, we'll study. But look at sirata al-lazina. So, al is is singular. al is plural. What do you form out of this Sirat al Ladina? Sirat al Ladina. The path, remember what I'm saying? The path of those. What did I say? The path of those. So what, did, what does it mean? Mudaf mudaf ilayhi. You got the idea? What is Sirat al Ladina? Mudaf Mudaf ilayhi. The path of those. So see, I use of. So it is Mudaf Mudaf ilayhi. Now, Al Ladina is Mudaf ilayhi. And it is a Mausula. Okay? Now we should have a Silatul Mausul. There is a Silatul Mausul. An Amta alayhim. So what will be An Amta? See, what is Ta here? What is ta here, brother and sister? Ta is a file. Okay? You know, I tell you your ability. Huh? I'm writing a verb and I want you to conjugate it. This verb we'll be studying in book four. Huh? Anama. What is the verb? Can you conjugate? I bet you can conjugate. Anama. Anama. Ana amu, ana amat, ana amata, ana amna, ana amta, ana amtuma, ana amtum, ana amti, ana amtuma, ana amtunna, ana amtu, ana amna. See, how did you do it? You just started learning Arabic and you can conjugate this? It's amazing. So but you see, huh? Sorry, the verb is four letter in this case. Yeah, we are going to learn this. The root, brother, you know I told you in the beginning all the verbs will go to the three letter root. What is the root of anama? Naama. Naama, naama, naama. Blessing. Blessing. Naama. And you know, niyama. And also in am comes from here. It's a masdar. The, all these things we will be studying. Ji? Naima, yes, yes. Naima. Uh, so, so all, see, the, the root of your word is Naama. Uh, but the Arabic is fascinating. There is no language like Arabic, you know. Okay. All these things we will be doing in the book three. Now, the thing is, uh, Sister Salma, Sirat al-Ladheena. Mudaf, mudaf ilayhi. And then al azina is ism mausula. Then where is the silatul mausul? Ana amta alayhi. Is it? So if you were to describe that uh, ism mausula in the definition form, how would you describe it? Uh, no. Ism mausula, when you will see al ladhi al Right now we are only doing al ladhi al lati uh, Mornas and muzakar form. Okay? And later on, we'll be doing Al-Lazina, Al-Lati, uh, and then also Al-Lazani will come. But those are all book three. So we should not worry about this. My point is only this, brothers and sisters. As I said, I'm not supposed to do it, but I'm still doing it 
Because I feel if I do it now, little by little, you'll get stronger and stronger, inshallah. So, brothers and sisters, the point is, the, okay, Tilkar sayaratul jamilatu. Fahida? Allati came. Allati is also a nath. Like jamilatu, Allati is also a nath. Huh? Okay? Kharajat al ana minal. Kharajatil ana minal. Madrasati is your. Uh, the whole sentence, Jumla Felia, is your Silatul Mausul. Put it into bracket, you know. Even if you put it into bracket, later on when you will revise, you will understand, inshallah. Lil Mudiri is your Jar Majur Shibu Jumla Khabar. Now, brother, Anta Mohandisun Ya Sayyidi. No, Ya Sayyidi means, O oh, Sir. Huh? Sir, you know, and Madam, okay. Anta Mohandisun Ya Sayyidi, are you an engineer? Sir, are you an engineer? La. No. Ana Tabibun. No, Sayyidi is a masculine. And what will be the monas? Sayyidati. Sayyidati. Madam. Okay. Sayyidun and Sayyidatun. Huh? Ya is your La, Ya is Mutakallim. Ya is Mutakallim. Huh? Okay? Fine. Anti Tabibatun Ya Sayyidati. Are you a doctor? Ma'am? Are you a doctor? What is the answer? La. Ana. I am I am a teacher. Fine brother? Okay brother. We are still uh, seven minutes to tea time but the halwa puri has come right away now. The next next uh, question is all halwa puri brother. Huh? You will be able to do it because the exercise that we do you will you know it brother. Ikra kulla jumlatin min al jumla al atiyati. Thum ikraha maratan ukhra. Maratan ukhra means one more time. Bada taghiri by changing al munada. Remember I said munada. Kama huwa muwaddahum fil misal. Okay, brother. Look at the misal. Huh? Change huh? the person whom you are addressing. And when you change the person, some changes will occur in the sentence. Okay? Aina kalamuka ya bi. What is the translation? Where is your pen, oh my God? Oh, so you said kalamuka. Now, if you are, want to ask your mother, how will you say aina? Well, come on, give me a break. This is too easy. <laughs> huh? This is too easy. So, all that you have to do is just change masculine into feminine, brother. Aina baitu. Aina baitu ka. See? Aina baitu ka. Ya Sayyidi. So now. Oh, I did I? Okay, sorry. Okay. Ainda ka kalamun ya Muhammad. What will you say now? Ainda ki kalamun ya. We know this. We are now expert. Alhamdulillah. Would you agree with me, brother Hassan? We can do it with ease. Huh? Would you like to call this uh, uh, halwa puri or shall we call it uh, bajia pakoda? <laughs> okay. Aina baitu ka ya sayyidi. What will you say? Aina baitu ki ya Oh, that's all you have to do, brother and sister. But here is my warning. If you won't write it, then you know, you will not become strong. You've got to write it. By writing those ka ki with the noun will make you strong. Are you with me, brother Farooq? I know you are busy. But one has to find time, brother. you got to find time. Work hard as much as you can. This is a jihad for us. Huh? we got to learn this language in seven months, inshallah. Ahada daftaru lakaya Ali, 
What will you say? Ya Fatima, Ahaza Daftaru Laki, Khalas, that's all. Next one, brother. Minaina Anta Yahi. Minaina Anti Yahi. Ukhti. Aina and Minaina Anti Ya Ukhti. Okay. Aina Abuka Ya Khalid. Aina Abuki Ya Khatija. Okay. Uh, Anta Maridun Ya Khali. Anti Maridatun. See, now get to watch. Huh? Anti Maridatun Ya Khalati. Fine, brother. Are you with me? Did anybody ask any question? No. Aina Bintuka Ya Ammi. Aina Bintuka Ya Ammi. Aina Bintuki Ya Ammati. Okay. Alaka Akhun Ya Hamid. Alaki Akhun Ya Suat. Maza in the Kayahi, what do you have? Maza in the Ki Yaukti. Brother, look at this. Assalamu alaika ya bi. What will you say to the mother? Assalamu alaiki ya ummi. ummi. Now, didn't I tell you it was Alwa Puri? She said Naima. Huh? Annis. Make muannas. Annis. Al-fa'il fi kullin min al-jumal al-ati ati. Okay? Fine, brother. Misal. Khalaja Muhammadun min al-bayti. What is now the monas? Kharajat aminatu min al See, now we know it, inshallah. We practiced for a few days, so we are very strong. Zahab al Mudarrisu ila al-fasli. No. Zahabat al-mudarrisatu. You will make it mournless. Al-mudarrisatu ila al-fasli. Zahaba abi ila al-mustashfa. Zahabat ummi ila al So if you will write it, you will become strong. Jalasat talibu fil fasli. Jalasat talibatu fil fasli. Very good. Kharaja akhi min al-bayti. Kharajat ukhti min al-bayti. Now you have to ponder on this. Ta'ammal ma yali. Ponder what follows. Jalasat talibu. How will you pronounce it? Jalasat talibu. Jalasat talibu. Because talibu is a sun letter. Okay, now when you change it, brothers and sisters, Something will happen. Okay. I am putting here Shadda. Ah, Sahi. This is a Sukoon here, brother. Are you with me? And what is this? What is this, brothers and sisters? Hamzatul huh? Basal. I cannot pronounce it because something else comes in the front. So, this is not to be pronounced. Huh? And this also, because it is a sun letter, I cannot pronounce it. But there are two sukuns now. Hmm? So, what will happen now? In order to pronounce it, I make a little surgery and I give it a kasra. Huh? 